Hi everyone, it's Tammy. <clears throat> and I have my package from Sweet Kawaii. I believe this is going to be for February. They always send two months ahead. So goodness gracious, I can't open the daggone thing. I know that, I just forget. The tape is so sticky. Yes, it's a Valentine's. Oh, and it's adorable. So I still get the itty bitty kit and I'm going to continue that for the year, I think. And um, it comes with a calendar, which I haven't figured out exactly what to do with those. If you guys get these, what do you guys do with these? I have my January one sitting over here waiting for me to figure out what I'm going to do with it. I was kind of thinking I might make a desk calendar and put these on it. I don't know. And then it has the I only have fries for you. That's funny. And the wacky holidays. So there's a funny holiday for every day of the month. Cute. Random act of kindness day, February 17th. And then there are some headers and half boxes. Excuse me. Mm. And some full some fun full boxes. I will always love you. I've got a lot of stuff to do. Just my type. Live by the sun. Love by the moon. OPs. <laughs> oh, hey there, cute tea. <laughs> I love you a latte. And then there's cute like pancakes and uh, syrup, like things that go together. Cookies and milk, popcorn and movies, uh, peanut butter and jelly. And then here are the, uh, I don't know what you call them, but whatever. The little arrow things. And some more full boxes and functionals. Hello, February. What's poppin'? Same full body, full uh, boxes, some functionals, some quarter boxes. And then here are the days of the week and the days, the dates and functionals and some washi. So I think what I'm going to do is go ahead and put these in my planner for next year. I've already done January and I really kind of like how it turned out. So that's why I'm thinking I'm just going to continue to do the same thing for the months with um, the itty bitty because I think it works out just fine. So this is my January and I'm going to put my video ideas for YouTube in here. And then when I schedule my YouTube videos, I'm going to write them in or around these little boxes. That's what those are for. And then I have um, who I need to send cards to this month and things that I want to clean out on um, in January. So then I thought that I would do the same thing for February. And um, my planner for next year is a little, a lot different. I love that it has birthdays already in it. I um, paid a little extra for that. This is a plum paper planner. And I think it was only $5 though. And then the calendar is a lot different. So I'm not sure exactly how I'm gonna use this yet. You guys will have to wait and see. I'm planning on, planning on, pun intended, doing my plan with me's again in the new year. I have been really bad at it this end of this year, but um, for good reason, I've just, you know, had things going on. So anyway, let's go ahead and plan February. So the first thing I did was I took this for January and I put it on this. Dear 2021, please be kind. I think that is nice. And I'm going to do the same thing for February. Sometimes I feel like I collect these things instead of using them. So I'm telling myself to use them. It's okay. Feel free. I buy them for a purpose. I may as well use them. There's that. I only have fries for you. <laughs> and then I'm going to put one of these to cover the day of the week. And see how that fits just perfectly, the itty bitty size. So I'm kind of happy with it. I'm not hating it at all.
feel like Tuesday's a little crooked. Now I could take them out and do them, but I don't know. I'm living dangerously. Oops. One thing I love about Sweet Kawaii stickers is that they are vinyl and they are very removable. When you first stick them down, you can get them up. I've never had any issues at all. And then the longer they stay in a, specific, in a particular spot, the stronger they get adhesed. Adhesed? Is that a word? The stronger they stick. So um, you do have to, you know, you have time to change it if you need to or whatever. And these little date cover-ups seem to work just fine in this planner too, which I thought was fabulous. Now, it's kind of silly, I know, to go and put these little date cover-ups on there. It's, the date's already on there. Why do I do this? I have no idea. This is more for a planner that isn't dated, but I don't know. Maybe I won't do all that with you guys. Maybe I'll go back and do that. So let me see my birthdays. I have my nieces, my cousins, my friends. And there's Groundhog's Day, President's Day, and Valentine's Day. So I'm going to put these little heart balloons on Valentine's Day. I'm going to put the cake on Cassie's birthday, my niece. The present on uh, Jacinda's birthday, I think, my cousin, and a piece of cake on Bridget's birthday, my friend. And there's also stickers so that you can, like, cleaning schedule and stuff like that, which I may start using. I'm not sure yet. Oh, I could put the paydays down. Let me see when oh, I get paid that last Friday, so I get paid then on this Friday. And then on this Friday. And I guess I could put the mortgage payment on, because I'll pay the mortgage here for March. I know I saw it. And I'm going to put my wacky holidays down. And I'll put some washi down. So let's do with the wacky holidays. Serpent Day is February 1st. Tater Tot Day. <laughs> Carrot Cake Day. Thank a Mail Carrier Day. Nutella Day. Do you guys love Nutella? Seems like you either love it or you hate it. And I'm kind of an odd bird. I just like it. It's all right. I don't love it. Frozen Yogurt Day. I love frozen yogurt. Send a card to a friend day. Oh, that's a good one. And it's on a Sunday. That's kind of weird. Fly a Kite Day because the mail doesn't get run on Sundays. That's why I said that was weird. Pizza day on Bridget's birthday. She'd like that. Who wouldn't? Umbrella day. Not sure what that means exactly. Inventor's day. Maybe because my niece is so smart. Plum pudding day. I have never had plum pudding, have you? Tortellini Day. Now, I love me some tortellini, and that's on Valentine's Day. Maybe I'll have to make myself some tortellini. Oh, wait. I'm a day off. Oh, I skipped a day. Oops. So, here we go. Umbrella Day is the 10th. You guys were probably yelling at me. Inventor's Day is the day before my niece's birthday. Oh, well, she's still smart. 
and plum pudding day is her birthday. So another dessert birthday. That's fun. Followed by tortellini day on February 13th. Oops. Now, Valentine's Day, President's Day is also Single Awareness Day, Almond Day, Random Act of Kindness Day, Drink Wine Day, now these are days I can get behind, Chocolate Mint Day, this whole week is a pretty good one. Cherry pie day. Holy cow. Sticky bun day. <laughs> Margarita day. Dog biscuit day. Maybe I could make dog biscuits and do a posting that day. Tortilla Chip Day. Clam Chowda Day. Pistachio Day. Strawberry Day. And the month finishes with Tooth Fairy Day. <laughs> all right, so there's all the wacky holidays. Let's put some washi up in here. Let's see, which one do I like best? I might like this one. I'm just gonna stick this right up here. And then I think I'll use this one for this side. And then on January, I did something over here. What did I do? I'm gonna see. Cause I remember thinking, oh, that fit perfectly. Oh, it was one that said stay home. I wonder if I have that one cause I still need to stay home in February. Nope, but that's okay. I will use a different one. I'm going to use this one that says, Hello, February, what's popping? Because, oh no, I could use it right here. Okay, I'm going to use this one right here. I lied. I didn't realize there was a day that was open before the month began. So I'll use that one for Hello, February. And on this one, I wonder if a big one will fit. No, not really. Okay, I need a quarter box or a half box. Or something fun. Maybe I'll use this wine and cheese since it's February. There we go. And then I'm going to take Some of my other stickers. Let's see. I only have fries for you. Hey there, QT. I like that one. I'm going to use that one. I'm just going to fill in some of these boxes that aren't don't have days like the month is over. Just my type. Than this little Cupid guy, I think. And then I'm going to put one that I can write in here and over here, I think. And 
I'll do another one. Uh, let's see here. I think I will do this one over here. And then I'm going to put that Happy Mail sticker over here with one of these. So I will know who I need to mail some stuff to. And what else did I put in here? Oh, things that I needed to clean. I think I might leave it un... Like, I don't think I'm going to label it yet. I think I'll just put a little guy. And one of these little guys. And then I can label it however I feel. And then I will put one of these in each day or on each day. And if this doesn't work out well, if I figure that out in January that this idea doesn't work well, then I'll change it up for March, I suppose. But I don't know why it wouldn't. I think it'll be all right. Ooh, that is crooked. Hopefully that's a little better. I love the idea of new planners. I'm hoping that I use this like I used to use them. I love, I love planners. So I'm just not even gonna say I hope I'm gonna use it. And I'm gonna use my hobo. And I'm gonna be organized and I have to be, I have things going on. I'm gonna be a grandma. I'm going to be a mother-in-law. I'm going to be single. I'm going to be 50. <laughs> I have a lot of things going on. No kidding. Those are getting crookeder, more crooked and more crooked, aren't they? Crooked air, crookeder. I'm not too awfully worried about it. I mean, I want them to be straight, but I'm not a total stickler. But I am, that would bug me enough that I'd want to move it, I guess. I didn't do the dates with you guys, but I'm doing this with you guys. That doesn't make a ton of sense, does it? Sorry. Hopefully I'm not too boring. So when I'm taping this, Christmas is about a week away. I cannot even believe it. So it's almost time to start using this planner. And COVID is going strong still. Crazy.
I really like this idea because I think it makes it look pretty and it makes me want to use it. So um, that's that's the whole reason that I like to decorate my planner and to plan like this is because it makes me want to use it. And when I use it, I feel a lot better. I have things written down. I don't have to worry about forgetting things so much. It's also fun for me to look back and see what I did. And I can't tell you how many times I've had to look back and say, oh yeah, this was on that day or whatever. It's just helps. It's just fabulous all the way around for me. So hopefully if you guys, if those kinds of things appeal to you, you guys will try the planner world. You don't have to decorate it like this, but I'll tell you what, it's fun. I think in my head. That's the last one. I guess I could do another header over here. With another one of these. And let's see, I'm gonna use a pink. So with the Sweet Kawaii, you do need to use like a Sharpie. So I got a whole set of these little mini Sharpies to use and they work out great. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm gonna write in here video ideas and I'm going to write um, homemade dog biscuits because it's dog biscuit day on the 23rd And then over here, I'm going to write cards too, because I need to write who I need to do cards for. Um, and then, hmm, I guess I will write too clean. I don't know exactly what. I can't plan that far ahead yet, but I'll put that there because it will start to be, I mean, I need to start thinking about spring. So, and then I don't use these on the actual paper because they do bleed through. So I'm going to get a pink sparkly pin and I'm going to make my card list. Now, one thing I noticed, or I remembered that I didn't do on here was to actually put the birthdays that I need to send a card to. So there are some here that I need to put for my birthday. So I need to do the same over here. I know I need to send a card to my niece, Cassie. And Jacinda's birthday is the fourth. So I should actually send her card this month. So I'm going to put that over here. Same with March. I know that March 6th is Tracy's birthday, so I'm going to put Tracy over here. And then I also need to put Bridget. And I'm going to put Katie and Alex, because I like to send them a card at least once a month. And then I'm going to get my little list out. And it is Valentine's, so there might be a little more than usual. I'm going to put one for my aunt. And I'm going to put one of my friends. And my brother. And another friend. And Lisa, because it's Valentine's Day. I think that's good. And let's see here. I wonder if I can fit another One of these. 
these since I got a little long. There we go. So that is that. That is how I'm going to use these. And then I still have plenty to use in other things or to add on if I need to or whatever. I think it's really fun and I'm hoping that I will use them more this way. I have really been enjoying it, uh, putting them, I mean, this is fun to me. So, and I will use some of these because I know that I need to, uh, you know, refill my prescription. I need to go to the grocery. This is farmer's market-y to me, read. So I, I have plenty more to use. So I'm going to keep these handy and I can hopefully use them in the month. So that's what I'm going to do. So thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate all of you, and I will talk to you soon.